good morning, good afternoon, or good evening for whatever time zone you're in. My name is Joanne Roll. I'm the Dean of the School of Business here at Mega Everest College. It is indeed our honor and our privilege to co-host this event with our dear friends, the Center for Business and Economics Research. Uh, the conference, as you know, will go from June 10th to the 12th. And we have over 70 wonderful presentations. Uh, we have more participants than last year from 25 different countries. And at Megar Evers College, we have about 15 who are scheduled to come before you with their research and their activity that we have done within the last year. COVID has not stopped us. We continue in the fine academic tradition of our work supporting those in need, all of our stakeholders, including our students, our community, and those domestically as well as international uh, and abroad. I am I'm, I'm, I'm indeed privileged to say that later in the uh, uh, conference exactly tomorrow, we will have our brand new CEO and president of Megar Everett's College City University of New York, the sixth president of Megar Everett's College, Dr. Patricia Ramsey. In her own right, she is a scholar and she is an academician, but she is here now to lead this fine institution uh, into the next level. I also want to say that, you know, this year we have something that hasn't happened before and we are happy about it. We have collaborations between our uh, liberal arts faculty and our business faculty, and they will be presenting. We have uh, collaborations and presentations from graduate students and faculty across both business and science, and that is coming to you as well. And we also have a special presentation in terms of a book launch that we will explain more to you on uh, tomorrow. I just want to say we have fine uh, uh, keynote speakers, and I just want to talk a little bit about the mega keynotes or the ones that we are bringing forward. Although all of the keynotes are going to be great, but I just know a little bit more about some of those who are are, are, are especially uh, ours. I first want to talk about Nia Rock. Nia is the Vice President and Community Development Officer at the Bank United, but that's just her title. Nia has been with with the School of Business Advisory Board almost from its inception. And although she has changed several institutions, she has adopted us. She has stayed with us, mentoring us, providing uh, opportunities for us, uh, working with our students, working with our faculty, and uh, uh, most uh, happily, she has been providing funding at the different institutions she has been with us. So Nia Rock is going to come to you and she's going to do a special presentation. Professor Zulfar Ahmed, he is the principal of Haley's College of Commerce, University of Punjab in Pakistan. He was our host, a uh, faculty member and myself, uh, Professor Byron Price, were there just in April where they did a wonderful conference and we presented two presentations ourselves. However, the mega team presented a host of papers uh, of which one was presented by our uh, our colleague and partner, LaShawn, Moh Mo uh, LaShawn Allen Mohammed, and surprisingly, she uh, won uh, from the uh, Central Brooklyn Economic uh, Development Group. Last year, they won best session, best paper in session. And this year in Pakistan, she won best paper in session about the wonderful work they're doing in economic development to help raise the boat of those in our communities and their income levels. And I'll talk a little bit more about that as I talk about my uh, presentation, which is a vision of, uh, of a better normal than what we've had in the past. Larry Young, 
is the managing partner and chief operating officer of B and C International. Him and his organization have done a lot of great domestic work, but what he's going to talk to you is about the network that he has internationally in Africa and how a group of African American business uh, men, as well as in other parts of the diaspora, are getting together to do more work and develop more on the continent. So we look for a, a lot coming out of that presentation. Uh, then we also have Dave Dorwich. Dave is a senior vice president and chief financial officer. And in the, uh, in the bio, it says international businesses, but he is with Prudential. And he is a long serving senior executive in the role of chief financial officer. And Dave is also on our advisory board. It was Dave who told us when we were looking at places to go to take the students to learn more about entrepreneurship, that if we were going to China, we were going so far that we might as well stop in on Japan and Thailand. And he was our host in Japan. And the students really admired seeing someone like him in that very prestigious role and how he has been in that industry for so long and he's coming uh, to bring a few words uh, of wisdom as as well. And so I do believe that you're going to get a lot from the conference. We're going to be able to share with each other. But what I want to encourage you that even though we are remote, even though we are online, network, network with those who are in your field and those who are in fields that you are interested in. Don't just listen to the papers, but take the contact information, email some of those authors, as well as some of the administrators of places you might like to go or other conferences you might like to be in. Uh, uh, Professor Dada's group run four or five conferences as uh, responsible for several journal publications. And so he and his team are a good group to learn and share with. And with that, I'm going to stop because uh, I don't want to take up too much time. You can see I'm excited about the possibilities of this conference. I hope you will be too. Enjoy the conference and have a great time. Thank you.